there's a $4 billion market that begins where the road ends. Farmers and suburban homeowners using garden tractors for tilling the soil, mowing lawns, clearing snow. Small trucks moving men and materials over ranches and estates. Rescue vehicles going where they're needed. Oil prospectors and engineers staking out remote parts of the world. People getting away from cities to hunt and play. A $4 billion market, but not without its problems. Garden tractors are limited in their use. Pickup trucks, limited in what they can do. Most rescue vehicles can't penetrate real wilderness. And vehicles that can are complex to maintain. In a world of rising costs, off-road fun for many is no longer affordable. Vehicles designed to carry six, carrying one. Wasted space, no longer tolerable. Clearly, there's a real need for a simple four-wheel drive vehicle that's economical to maintain, easy to repair, inexpensive, yet reliable and rugged, even under the toughest conditions. How would we build it? We start with a corrosion-resistant frame formed from low-carbon alloy steel tubes. Lightweight and tough. We add a suspension system with ample wheel travel using coil springs, front and rear, that keeps all four wheels firmly on the ground on uneven road surfaces. We control roll and spread the load evenly through coaxially mounted heavy-duty shock absorbers. Simple, safe, reliable. We design in a generous ground clearance by using 15-inch diameter wheels mounted with wide section tires so as not to sink in soft dirt. Make sure there's no dangling oil lines or fuel pipes, no exposed transmission shafts, no problems from undergrowth. The power goes directly to the front and rear solid axles through special gear trains geared for pulling or urban commuting. The drive line and suspension linkage is designed to be simple yet rugged. We position the engine amidships, mounted transversely, a two-cylinder, 30 to 40 horsepower, air-cooled, or a four-cylinder, up to 75 horsepower, both off the shelf, mass-produced, so you can get parts anywhere. On most present cross-country vehicles, the load space is less than a third of the length, the engine taking up another third, and two persons the rest, a waste. On our unit, more than two-thirds of the length is hauling space, useful space. The load platform is a simple composite structural sheet. The problem with usual utility vehicles is field repairs. With ours, remove the lightweight flooring to get at the entire powertrain for rapid replacement or repair. Driver and passenger sit above and ahead of the wheels. Good visibility. This driving position creates confidence in the vehicle. No more guessing what's beyond a big hood when descending a steep hill. You can see. Rugged simplicity, very low cost, four-wheel drive, large utility space, half-ton capacity, and ability to go anywhere, to play, to explore, to haul, rescue. Commute. power takeoff makes it a traveling do-all. You can run an alternator or generator, compressors, saws, water pumps, a high-pressure sprayer, or just about anything. It literally puts a shop in the field. A front power takeoff can run power-assisted lifts or snow throwers. 
They plan on making two versions, one for off-road alone, the other for road travel as well. Summer, winter, anytime. Four-wheel drive, simple, low cost, fuel efficient. A new road into a $4 billion market, the DMC 44. Wheels for our time.